All right, I'm back. I've done a couple changes. I actually got a nice meter now. Got a clamp on DC amp meter. I also have a thermocouple hooked up to that. I've added a cooler to my uh, eight plate setup. I this is actually a heater core out of a Volkswagen Passat, I think it was. Yeah, it's something I worked on. I'm using this to keep my cell below 180 degrees. Um, I have my coolant return on the top, and I have a hose coming out the bottom. That goes to this fancy little $7 washer fluid pump that's at least been told to me that's able to sustain long periods. Uh, I'm going to drop the voltage on this to 6 volts, that way I'm not running so hot. I actually burned out my washer fluid pump that I initially tried, so we'll see how that goes. But it act it does really, really well. I mean, it, I haven't hit anything over 150 degrees. Um, I'm getting ready to step this thing up to 24 volts. I have a couple of cooling fans that I'm going to pop onto that, just little computer ones that draw like a quarter of an amp. So overall wattage of the system, I mean, that at 6 volts is, I'm expecting it to draw about an amp, maybe an amp and a half. And then over here, they're, I mean, 12 volts at a quarter of an amp. The cell itself, I've uh, measured the amperage out of this at about 150 degrees, excuse me, uh, to be about 20 to 25 amps, depending on how hot and uh, how well charged the batteries are. I'm just shy of one liter per minute, so really happy about that. Bubbler's working well. Um, like in my old other video, um, other than this top uh, outlet that I've added, this is actually the gas coming out of the top versus the old one that I had. That's actually I'm using as coolant return. Uh, going in to the bubbler, coming out of the bubbler, I have a valve. I have a very fine uh, steel wool flashback arrestor. I know a lot of people are saying use bronze, but I've done pretty well with this. And then the torch that I've... Uh, constructed. I actually copied this from someone else on YouTube, but it works exceedingly well. It's a 0 .00, 0 .025 MIG welding tip, and it's just made of brass. I also have a little uh, one-way check valve. It's decent, but I'm probably going to pull it out. So all I'm waiting for is my cooling fans, and I'll uh, fire it up, see what my production is. Alright, see ya.